Definitely coming out on top. A little too close here for the Marines. We should definitely be scanning here, but it doesn't look like anything of like that sort is going to happen. It's scan coming a little bit too late, in my opinion. Anyway, look at this. I've got one gold. I've already, I've already got my SCV, my probes ready with the gold. They are going to go and dash, mad dash to the Nexus. Once it finishes, I'm building a second one over here. The these little units taking out my my buildings remaining here, and I think I pinged over here. Yeah, definitely, I was like, oh, I was telling him, that's pretty nice, but definitely not as nice as a double gold. <laughs> anyway, what is going on over here? These tanks, running marines into the tanks, not a good idea, but it looks like they're going to be able to brute force their way out of this. Maybe it's very close, it's really close. Who's going to come out on top? It does not really know. And it looks like Orange is barely able to hold those two armies together with red and blue combined. One tank standing, two Hellions, a couple Marauders coming here, but the Marines again harassing. What is Red up to? I mean, he just wasted all his units on that little attack. What is Teal up to? He is trying to expand. He does not have much going on. My base is officially nullified. There is only one cannon standing, but look at this, guys. Full macro mode. Let's take a look at the income. My income is about to start shooting up. I mean, once I start saturating, I've already caught up with everyone. Oh, man. I'm actually ahead of everyone in income. Oh, boy. This is too funny. Too, too funny. The, the, dual, the typical Aegis build. Lose your... Do a proxy cannon rush, lose your nexus, and double expand into the gold. Get ahead of everyone in income, although Blue is not that far behind. He definitely has his second base over here. Though not much else going on. His macro not very good. As you can see, we got Teal going over here. And my friend actually saying we need to scan to see what these guys are up to. Because we are doing the typical old mass battle cruiser rush with tank defense and proxy cannon. Jeez. Definitely our favorite build, but as you can see, Teal here is only trying to check out what is going on. He's trying to take the gold, which I mean, that's kind of out of the way. I would definitely recommend he take out this natural expansion here, although that is technically reds, but what is... I mean, he's still just barely recovering from the, that horrible, horrible Hellion Massacre. Although, look at this, he's got a second command center, so maybe I should eat my words and just let, <laughs> let him play, because he's doing very well. And what do I have going on here? I got four gateways, but I do not think I stick on this list for very long. As you can see, I am still making more than anyone else, Mr. No Nexus. The, my opponent's fairly sure they do not see that. If not, I would have all kinds of people all up in my face. Definitely not the kind of builds I would recommend for you to go and... Oh, man. This is so funny. <laughs> Mass battle cruisers incoming to blue space, and he has. This is not enough marines, guys. I don't know if you realize that. That is definitely not enough marines. Have some of marauders over here, just kind of make sure I'm not taking my own expansion. I think I sent some probe uh, to his death at some point in time over there. Teal here trying to take the gold, but really, you should be focusing on your macro. All these buildings are producing nothing, man. This is a big mistake, guys. Look at here. The battle cruisers just got here. Battle cruiser operation well, is now destroying Blue's base. Look at the burning bodies. A devastation. It is obliteration over here at Blue's base, and everyone that is Blue is invited. Oh, man. I'm trying to get Vikings, I guess, but this is not going to come anytime soon. These SCVs are hightailing it to the expansion. The <laughs> We've got a little uh, renegade me <laughs> guerrilla marine force here guarding this the expansion, but what good is that? What am I up to? Let's see. I'm not even producing anything. My macro slipping. I'm definitely enjoying this game too much and not even paying attention to what I'm doing. I'm definitely starting to notice that though. I'm putting down a couple of Stargates myself, and I think I'm scouting, yeah, as you can see, I'm actually scouting the map, and I see that they are trying to take this gold expo, but what good is it, do, is it going to do if I just scouted it? My friends here putting a siege line, which, yeah, and expand, oh, I'm, I'm triple expanding, guys. <laughs> Definitely not the builds you want to go. Just just to reiterate, just in case you didn't get that. Blue does not have much left here. Just supply depots. My friend is just like, eh, who cares about supply depots? These Vikings going to be hero Vikings trying to <laughs> kite the battle cruisers, But the battle cruisers say, yeah, whatever. I'm going to Yamato all up in your face, man. <laughs> 
Oh boy, trying to make um, as many Vikings as they can, but they cannot. And I still pinging over here, telling them we need to take that out before it starts to take effect. But really, what good is it going to do if they don't have any production buildings? They could have all the minerals in the world. <coughs> Excuse me, getting a little bit of my voice, losing my voice a little bit from all the casting going on here. And Red going sneaky, taking the gold expansion here on the island. But what else does he have going on? Not much. He's got a couple of Thors, which... Thors are good against light air, but they're not that great against battle cruisers, and they're definitely not gonna not in that amount of numbers. So Teal here trying to high tilt it out of there, trying to mass as many forces. But look at this. Oh man. Look at all these hellions. <laughs> not even waiting for the tanks, although I guess they're blocking tanks. I thought they were gonna siege, but it looks like they are not. Definitely gonna overrun this position. Look how much damage those tanks did in just two hits. Oh my goodness. I am transferring SCVs over here. What is going on? I am making void rays. Mass void rays and probably gonna transition into carriers, motherships, and all cards of sany crazy builds like the four fast expand. Oh man, I am too ridiculous. Anyway, what else is going on here? Looks like we're kind of just waiting. The battle cruisers are dominating everything. <laughs> the Terran player has lifted, though. What good is that going to do against the battle cruisers? I think battle cruisers do a little bit more damage to ground. Uh, let me see. Is this laser battery weapon ground? Yeah, ground actually gets a little bit more damage than than air. I didn't. I didn't. I, I had some idea that there was some different, but I didn't really know that. Look at this, so many Thors, but really, there are way too many battle cruisers here. Oh my goodness. Taking out this lone Viking who's trying to be a hero Viking, but could not do so. And more battle cruisers incoming over here. What is going on in my base? Oh man, definitely getting critical mass on the on the void rays over here, but it looks like what I'm really running low on is gas. Trying to expand all over the place. I mean, my opponents, what are they do gonna do at this point in time? God, Yamato cannons all over <laughs> the place. Oh man, and here I'm taunting Blue because he's the one that took me out, so I am going with Maz Void Rays and I'm gonna go take his base out. <laughs> the remains, while these battle cruisers do all the damage and my opponents start to just leave one after one. And it looks like that's gonna be it for it. My Blue talking a little bit back, but really, I mean. Oh, this, this was just too funny of a game. I went from the typical Aegis 3v3 build, patented, go with a cheese rush, with a cannon rush, lose your nexus, then triple expand, four expand, and then go mass void race. So I hope you guys like that, Lana. Uh, this, these games are just for fun. I have not really been laddering too much. I took kind of a break, but also I was really working on trying to get the introduction to the basics videos down, which I am still working on. I am having some problems, so don't think that I... Just kind of high-tailed it after getting a couple of subscribers and just said, ah, whatever, give up or anything. I'm just trying to come to resolution with what are the best build orders for beginner players. I want to make sure I give you good advice when I give you advice that's specific. And, uh, yeah, really been working on that, and I will try to get to as soon as possible. The Terran one should be up by now. And again, I'm going to stop talking. I think I'm going to lose my throat over here. So just as always, guys, please rate, subscribe, comment, like, visit other commentators' channels like Husky Starcraft, HD Starcraft, and Day9. Thank you for watching. And those of you who have subscribed, if you have any requests, please let me know. And uh, that, with that, I, I will stop rambling. I will see you guys next time, and have a good day, guys.